I... I once put out a fire using my neighbour's milk. <laughs> yeah, are these tea? Is that possible? <laughs> was, it a, was it a very small fire? Um, it was... It was, you know, a fire... Say, say for example, that desk was on fire. It'd be about, it was about that big. And it wasn't just one neighbour's, it was... It was about 15 neighbours. 15 neighbours? What? <laughs> what time of day was this? In the morning, when the milk came. <laughs> One of your neighbours were up early enough to bring the milk. It was a Saturday. It was a Saturday. Because <laughs> it's a Saturday, you have to lie in and you get double milk because of the Sunday, you know. So what was on fire, please? It was just on, the, like, a, on like, a field, there was, like, some dried grass. Just and... a bonfire, then? <laughs> well, it, no, it just sort of... We just thought, oh, look at that dried grass, let's set it on fire. And, you know, that's what you do when what? you're 25. And you... <laughs> and, uh... <laughs> I think we were about eight or nine. But basically, you're an arsonist. You started the fire... Yes. ..and then stole some milk in order to put it out. <laughs> yeah, yeah. When it could have just burnt out quite happily on its own. There was no need, really, to pour... Yeah, but at eight... I it mean, eight. I've not got this knowledge of fire. We'd, I'd seen three episodes of London's Burning. I don't know what I mean. <laughs> I'm not sure that adds up, Jason. <laughs> How long's London's Burning been on? I think you can believe him, he's seen London's Burning. <laughs> I'm not sure London's Burning, the programme, was on. So you're disputing when London's Burning first came onto our screen? Yeah. Yes, yes. Oh, that's it. Yes. Right, Jason was born in 1981, so he is alleging that by 1989, London's Burning was already on television. I, I believe 1981. him. 1981. <laughs> 1981. 1981. He looks like me uncle. <laughs> anyway, can we get back to the story? Yeah, that yeah, we're yeah, just yeah, yeah. How far did you have to go to get the milk? I was a kid. I, I didn't measure it. I, I mean, mean, about. Well, give us a rough. Tw twelve and a half metres. About. <laughs> Right. Why don't you just get a knock at the door and say, quick, quick, the, the field's on fire? Because then that would be admitting yeah. that Peter there was Jr. a fire. Whereas in this instant, the only thing that happened was a milkman got sacked for not delivering milk. I think... <laughs> In other words, just to clarify, before we say our decision, you, te you took how many bottles of milk to, to put out the fire? Um, f 15 or Ah, 15. 15, 10. Well, I take you back to your earlier answer, which was 15 houses, and on a Saturday they got double milk. <laughs> Fair-minded, he took one pint from each <laughs> So what are you going to say, Lee? What, what, what are you going for here? Oh, they, they, I they, don't know now. The whole answer was delivered in such an implausible and, frankly, guilty-sounding way. <laughs> yeah. What do you think we're having? Uh, I think it's a truth. Well, Jason, where were, you, where were you brought up? Manchester. Yeah, you see, I was brought up around Manchester, and I can imagine the bit about you saying, all right, let's go in there and set fire to a field. Believable. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, no, that's a bit big. Better put it out with some milk and be good citizens. Yeah. Doesn't really sort of add up. <laughs> so what are you going to plump for? You're saying the truth. Truth. You're saying a lie. Yeah. I'll go with, I'll go with Miranda and say yeah. we think that's the truth. You're saying it's the truth. OK, well, so, uh, Jason, is it, it the truth? It is a truth. Ah. Ah. Well, 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 well.